What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video and today we are going to be playing more Spider-Man 2. Now in the last video we did some more story exploring and things like that, although it did get a little more interesting with the main bad guys. I don't know what his name is quite yet, but we'll just call them the Hunters. They stole some of the villains from previous series and things like that, and right now we are going to go talk to our Uncle Aaron. So, without further ado, let's jump straight into it. So I've been leveling up and getting a lot of things off camera because, well, I mean, a lot of it's just side story stuff, things like collecting the crystals, everything like that. Alright. So I got some new costumes. That's probably the biggest change of anything. I also got like some new skills, but I mainly spent that on the both of them because it kind of just increases my speed and stuff like that. Anyway, I'll see you guys when we get to the objective. Because I'll deal with this. And then I'll go to the objective, because... Whoa! They're gonna blow up the whole block! That's it! The fire's coming! The unworthy process on them... You'll regret running okay. the thing! Y'all are done! Take your place with the other world! Get ready to burn! I hate, dude, these enemy, the, that enemy in particular is so annoying. Uncle Aaron's waiting. Why am I so nervous? All right, we're back. We really got to do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Forget it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. Getting some? How did you? Hey, Miles. That Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, going to take I'm some serious. tech back. 
I've heard this dude could turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Probably illegal too. Now, what Hopefully else it isn't. Our school, college, anyone you like. I don't know. So there is someone. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. How do you the do that? Stays hidden until it that was quick. My suit. Here we go. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Ooh, you gotta really hold him down. Move to the position where you can yank the panel from the reveal location. Another gate. Gonna be very delicate with it. There we go. Wait. Can't pull it open from down here. Then we gotta go up here. That's really cool. You would have made a decent problem. You should be seeing how to get inside now. I'm already inside. Do we gotta scan for more prowler code? Oh no, it's just right here. I don't know if I should be stealing this tag. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? All suit prototypes. Feel Ooh. free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. You received a rare tech upgrade. Use your resource resources to unlock new suits, gadgets, and suit tech. Yeah. You can boost your combat and traversal. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, I'm definitely upgrading my health. Alright, hold on. I want to go to... Can I go to damage? Damage. Ooh, that's a lot. Hero tokens? Alright, I think we're, uh... I think we're good for now. This isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay. I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. I won't be. What am I gonna say about this? Prowler stash is unlocked. Miles, me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... Está bien. Sí, ma. Todo bien. It's how about you done to Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. Y... ¿Cómo está él? Está trotando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out to the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. I think I'm gonna find Lee this quickly. That was a crime over here. But can I see where the main... Oh, there's a lot of Prowler stashes over here. Oh, so those are just like your main... Uh, main area for like tech parts and stuff like that. Or at least from what I can assume. Miles, up there, remember? You on your way? Oh right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. Oh, hold on. Guns? Yeah, that's gotta stop. Deals off. Oh, now we got these guys, too? Swing kick enemies? This isn't gonna be good. Nope. 
Are they running away? No, they're just calling in reinforcements. There he is! Get him! Wait! One of you had time to check for help? Really? Get this? Nope. It didn't work. So wait, if I do this, is this swing kick? I don't know what a swing kick is. Yeah, I don't know what that is, but hey, we still got him. Oh, now y'all are calling it quits. Okay. City seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Oh, is this where we can? Cause I just saw something where you said you can. Yeah, you can switch to Pete. Re requires a different character, but you cannot switch characters right now. Oh. All right then. Let's go explore some of those stashes then. Why won't we? See you guys when I get there. Crisis averted, Genki. You were saying? Club fair, remember? You on your way? Oh right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. Have so many questions for him. Be there soon. Need my help. Wait, time to go. cut in. Ah. We're ending this now. Here we go. Yeah, I, bro, I literally I dodged that. Down. I literally dodged that. Dude, sometimes it's just like really annoying. Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Oh yeah, because she's trying to get the front page so she doesn't get fired or whatever. Alright, we're going to ignore that assault um, thing because we're going to try to get to the main mission. Oh, so this skin is looking fire, not gonna lie. Glad I got it. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. So this is supposed to be some sort of big new opportunity, I assume? Because we got fired. Feel like everyone's getting fired. That's Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. So, what do you think? Wait, isn't Norman supposed to be Green Goblin? 
It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Whoa, particle accelerators. Whatever all that other stuff says. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. I was gonna get a little teary eyed. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. Oh, that's the gift he gave us last episode. Was it last well, episode or the episode before that? It's downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. I mean, it's huge. Nothing set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Look what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. Dang. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. I actually know Dr. someone Young who's named Dr. Young. Super cool research on bees, or to be more precise, on bee predators. Bee predators? Isn't that basically like most insects and things that can eat bees? I feel like my dog would be a bee predator. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Yeah, sure. You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. There's a robot Harry bees. says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. What? Carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Bee wolves? Oh, is it gonna be like a little game? Oh, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA Aww. bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little oh. bee wolves? The better you are at shooting them, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! This reminds me of, um... I don't know what the game is called, but it has like similar graphics and like pixelated stuff. Oh yeah. Got to protect the hive. One more. Where is he? Right there. Nice. You're done, Peter. A very productive don't session. Don't, don't crash. You got great data. Okay. Going home. I don't know why I'm trying to shoot everyone. I'm supposed to be the hero here. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. Oh, I can move around here. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Oh, not this way. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge no, proton no, beam work, using protons instead of x-rays with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. How's it gonna make the world a better place? A particle accelerator, that is? Well, I guess we'll see. <laughs> it's it's soon it'll explain it. A moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. Oh, he only has I one arm. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety. 
Impulsive thoughts? <laughs> nope. I've never been better. I feel like everyone has those. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Oh, that's Listen, the lizard? I'll make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. I mean, I'll come meet you upstairs right now. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Those lobsters? No. I just saw red and for some reason I thought those were lobsters. Transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology. I don't know if those organs will work though. Oh, ooh, sorry, sir. I mean, ma'am. Uh oh. Wait, I can go on a bike? Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. What was that? Nice. I'll try to come back. There's a ton of sciencey stuff going on here. I have no idea what any of it means. Oh, sorry, ma'am. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. What are those? You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. What do I feel like this is being used for some genius mastermind evil plan? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle mm. school. Okay. Middle school was now, kind of a blur. That, hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. I don't think so I ever Dr. learned Boss about that. He's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Well, maybe some plant genetics, yeah. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. It's so calming and... We're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. I see what you're saying. The algorithm mm, but I won't. Long division, uh, if you look at it that way. So sorry. Mm -hmm. I mean, he was kind of in the way. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Sure, why not? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Oh, I did it. I don't even know what I did. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Yeah, let's start over. Okay, so this should probably go here. And then this should probably go here. This goes here, and then... Okay, this goes here. I don't think I did that right. I oh, know I did. I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest, One but... One step closer to feeding the world. Nice work. 
Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. Oh, it's then I need one son. Specifically adapted to urban gardens. Ah, I get it, I get it. So, I need one plant. One water. One sun. Let's see. Okay, 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 okay. One sun. One of these bad boys. One of these bad boys. And then... Hold on a minute. Okay, so plant up there, plant up there, and then, but what if I do, like, water up here, alright, water up here, sun right there, plant right there, right there, and then, beautiful work, Peter. There we go. Using this technology. We're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Mm. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. Really? But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. What was that? Someone just screamed at you guys. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? I still don't trust it for some reason. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> oh, hey, 
Uh, I forgot not to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. All right, with that being said, I think we'll go ahead and end it hey, off here. sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For Excuse real? me, Miles. Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... All right, then. It's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. All right. Now, with that being said, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video off here. Now, it has been a quite story-packed mission, a lot of emotions, a lot of character building, things like that. But I think in the next video, we're actually going to get into some the action-packed stuff. So if you do want to see that, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all that wonderful stuff. You know, it helps the algorithm. And until next time, I will see you guys then. Peace out.